Hello everyone and Merry Christmas to some of you and Merry Christmas Eve to the rest. I just wanted to make a small video today to show you something that I purchased that I'm really happy about. I'll be interested to see what you think. If you do have any comments or opinions on something, please feel free to leave them in the comment section below. The thumbs up is always appreciated. Let's us know that the content that we're making is appreciated. My son and I enjoy making these videos for others to also enjoy. If you do want to subscribe, please feel free to, but we don't want to make you feel like you have to, as no one has to. These videos are more for us to share with you all. If you want to be notified, usually, you know, you subscribe, or if you really like the content, then you let someone know by subscribing. So I'm going to go ahead and go grab those. And if you all uh, would be patient, I'll be right back. Thank you all so much for waiting. I do appreciate that. So I have here is the Sailor Moon Cup. It's one of three that I bought. This one was by itself. The other two came in a set. As you can see here, you have Sailor Moon. And there is the wording Sailor Moon with the crescent moon and a few other decorations. And actually, on this particular cup, it actually has an image on the back, which is Luna, and I thought that was really cute. Solid glass, it's not plastic, so very nice quality, and it's pretty thick, too. It's not really thin, so it's a solid cup, which was one of the many reasons why I really wanted to get this and felt good about getting it, because to me, you have to feel good about what you do, otherwise you regret it regret it later, later on. Sorry guys, lost my uh, words there for a minute. This one again was by itself and it's like a light pink, whereas the next cup I'm going to show you, which is one of the two that came in a set and is Luna, is a darker pink and more solid, whereas the other one I feel kind of is like a faded pink. And as you can see here, it's got the crescent moon and Luna's name on there with a few little stars fairly cute picture of Luna. She looks really happy. What I think is cool is when you bring out her counterpart, which is Artemis here, if you put them close enough together, you can't really line them up, otherwise one disappears over the other. Their tails actually form the little heart if you look at it close enough. So again, here's Luna. Now I'm going to give you a little more time to look at Artemis. So here's Artemis. I'm going to turn the cup a little bit more. His name's a little bit longer, but there you have it. Nothing on the back of his either, and these two came as a set. They were fairly inexpensive. I was uh, happy with that. Usually most of the Sailor Moon merchandise that I've come across is overpriced, combined with not being of good quality. Example is, I love Sailor Moon, and when I've gone into many craft shows, and stores you see a lot of Sailor Moon merchandise but it's not all of good quality the dolls are not really well made the attention to detail is very poor but then they're extremely overpriced um, I did see a figure once that I really appreciated had some doubts about maybe finding it cheaper somewhere else found that for the most part it was a little bit cheaper so I didn't feel so bad I haven't bought it yet still hesitating because most of the time like with figures I'm so picky that I end up talking myself out of it because unless it actually talks to me and I have no doubts about the figure then I'll buy it but if I have doubts of any kind and I'm sitting there you really scrutinizing it then that's my cue that hey you really don't want this nor do you really need it so let's just walk the other way didn't have that problem with these glasses they're solid glasses they're holographic, the image, they're good quality, the attention to detail is really good. I don't see any defects, um, imperfections, things of that nature. So I'm looking forward to seeing if I can find more like that because I think these would be a great display item. I have no desire to use these uh, in any fashion. They're strictly for looks and appreciation. One thing I thought was interesting about these though is when I was looking at the bottom, I, uh, I noticed that it has 14 plus. I've never bought a cup or glass that had 
an age indicator on it. I'm sure there are probably a few reasons why they did that, maybe for safety reasons. Perhaps they felt that the content was not appropriate. It could go many different ways. But another thing I did like about what I found on the bottom is that you know this is authentic because it's got the Toei animation emblem on it. So that helps you to know that this isn't some knockoff. And I can tell too by looking at the attention and the colors and everything that this is Sailor Moon, that it's not some knockoff because knockoffs, some are pretty good. I'll give them credit. But usually you can tell a knockoff right away because there's something off about it. I really appreciate your guys' time today. My son and I, again, like I said in the beginning, appreciate when everyone stops by. Again, if you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. If you feel like you have anything to contribute, you can definitely leave that in the comments below. Until next time, guys, thank you so much and take care.